Good morning, it's James. I do hope and pray this message finds you and your loved ones peaceful, thriving and well. It is awesome to lay eyes on you. And I'm gonna make a little bit of a guess here. And I'm gonna say, I bet you are tuning in in the morning. I just bet this is the morning for you because it seems as I look over the last seven, eight years of the treehouse, the vast majority, like 80% of our community checks in in the morning. That's when the comments come in, the hearts fly in, and I love comments and hearts, so it's beautiful to see them. And yes, by and large, they are coming in in the morning. And why do I love this? It's because of a study I wanna share with you today about morning people doing one thing. Yes, connecting is always good. We know from Harvard about having meaningful connection is great for longevity and all the cool things associated with biological aging. But guess what? I'm gonna give you an opportunity, consider to add another 16 years taken away from your biological age. Literally, aging 16 years less as you give yourself the opportunity to add a 20 minute walk four times a week. What is that? Roughly an hour and 20 minutes a week of brisk walking. It was really, really specific when they spoke to brisk walking. And the College of Sports Medicine said, this is when you know you're working it. <laughs> you're working it. And you work at such a degree that you're raising your heart rate and you're using your muscles and you're definitely are giving yourself permission to be uncomfortable for those 20 minutes. Not gas where you're like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna, uh, you know what I mean? It's more like I'm on it, but I'm feeling it. I'm strong, but I'm definitely winded in a good way. And they found that after 10 years, 16 years was lost in biological age. Oh my gosh. So when you hear something like that, and you think about, in fact, let's go ahead. I mean, you can walk in place. I'm gonna just, I'm leaving the tree house right now. And we're gonna go out for a brisk, let's take a brisk walk while you're, are, are, you are doing your brisk walking in place or maybe grabbing your phone and walking with me. Let's think about this. 16 years at the cell age. You know, I'm 59 and when I did my last testing of a questionnaire and a few other things, I actually biologically am about 28 years old. So. That's pretty awesome, and I work at it, I exercise, I eat a lot of plants, I hang out with smart, cool, kind, loving people. And I say, say smart, curious people, make me think, make me really stretch myself intellectually and spiritually and emotionally. And most importantly, I hang out with kind people who really support the way that I want my life to be out picturing when I look around my life. Moving our bodies is moving our soul. 16 years taken off your cells so your cells don't have the burden of carrying things we don't wanna carry. And I think what's beautiful, and this is what I find every time I come back from a walk, and I do it every single morning religiously with my wife, we never ever miss. I come back better. Every single time I come back better from my walk. I'm a better husband. I'm a better dad. I'm a better thinker. I'm a better dog dad. I'm a better <laughs> I'm just better. I make better choices. I'm more discerning. I'm more curious. I'm more present. I'm the me that I love to be. And I want to have you today consider how your self-care, your self-love and moving your body, all motion creates positive emotion. And think about that 20 minutes of brisk walking and hopefully Somebody in your neighborhood, someone in your family, someone, a stranger, it doesn't matter. They see you and they see you smiling and they see you getting after it and they go, oh, wow, there's a pollinator for permission. There's a catalyst for raising my life game. That's our job here. Self-care isn't just for us. It serves to wake up everyone around us and remind everyone that the human race wants to be more about human grace. So we get an opportunity to decide how it is that we are gonna lead our life, how it is that we are gonna bring forward a level of zeal and gratitude for the ability to move our body. Raising our heart is raising our vibration. Raising our vibration increases the likelihood for manifestation of all that we want, all that we desire, all that we came here to be. So enjoy your walk. Thank you for tuning in the morning and thank you for being who you are. I see you, I love you, and I appreciate you, and I believe in you. Peace and blessings. Bye for now.